iconic. We're just catching up on all that gossip. Uh, that iconic bench backdrop, but for the first time in 25 years, the beloved Sophie will swap its familiar setting for the rugged outback of South Australia. Now, the change of scenery follows on from last week's cliffhanger, uh, which saw Casey Braxton being kidnapped by Summer Bay's newest resident. It's all going on. Casey! Braxton and Natalie travelled to the deserted Flinders Ranges in search of Casey after they received several clues about where to find him. Supposed to all. She's got a set of lungs on you there, sir. Uh, it'll be a race against time to save him as it becomes a matter of life and death. Of course it does for the youngest river boy. Oh, it's got Mad Max written all over it. For more on what we can expect from tonight's nail biting episode, we're joined now by the three cast members, Lincoln Eunice, Nick Westaway and Steve Peacock. Good morning, guys. Thank you. Oh, Good morning. wow. <laughs> Lincoln, going to start with your first time uh, Home and Away has been filmed in the Outback. As an experience, uh, what was it like? Did they do nice catering out there? It was amazing catering, actually. No, it was, it was phenomenal. We, um... I've never been to a place like that, and um, Summer Bay certainly hasn't, so I don't know how we were lucky enough to, to kind of get that break, but um, it, it was probably one of the most outstanding places I've ever been Shots to. Are incredible. Oh, yeah, they're amazing. incredible, yeah, I know. Nick, you've kind of got that whole mean stare thing happening really well. I can't, I can't actually really look at you as I ask you, oh, look, look how nice he looks yeah. there, he's smiling. And this is pretty compelling stuff. What, what can you tell us about what we're going to see? Without giving too much away. Uh, yeah, of course, I can't give too much away. But yeah, no, the action packed couple of days coming up. Uh, obviously, you've seen me kidnap this one, so I'm going <laughs> to take him out to the desert and um, got a few surprises out there for him. But um, unfortunately, there are a few surprises that Kyle's going to experience out there as well. So uh, tune in and you'll find this one try to make it to him in time. This one try to fight his way out and we'll see how it all plays out. It's yeah. scary. <laughs> it's, the, it's the cute smiley one you've got to watch out for, Kyle. Oh, it's the dark side there. Uh, Steve, how's it going to unfold for us? What do we need to know? Well, you're going to see a lot of actors struggling to remember their lines and some wicked hangovers because we had some mean nights. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't, we, um, I'm we, sorry, the trouble for the has just fainted <laughs> over here. Can we just make a note one actor? <laughs> No, you can, we had everything. We had helicopters out there getting some awesome aerial shots. We had lots of, we had a few really cool um, stuntmen doing cool drive sequences, and it was a wicked big explosion. But just yeah, you see, you see this one trying to kill that one, and me trying to kill this one and save that one, and Casey just saving the day himself. Casey so. just wants water. Yeah, the whole time. <laughs> you, you, you don't know what's going to happen. It's very, very dangerous. It's pretty good. Hang on, hang on. You know how we can't get coffee anymore. Yeah. <laughs> These guys are out with helicopters, ah, stuntmen. We've had a bunch of flash. Well, you guys are in the outback. We got the recession. We took it. <laughs> 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 what can you tell us uh, behind your character's kidnapping? Like, what's, you know? Um, you didn't go through a hard time. I, I was watching that the other been. day. And he you has. Just, uh, you poor thing. Oh, someone like, asked me to describe Casey, and I was just like, tragedy. Yeah. <laughs> how, how are you going? I'm, 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 I'm good. Casey's in a world of pain. But, right. um, no, look, uh, the only thing we kind of know about the kidnapping is um, Kyle has been uh, stalking him for a few weeks. Um, he thinks there's a, a you know, a, a relationship between Kyle and, and possibly the Braxton family. Um, but that, that's, that's all he knows. And, and he wakes up in the boot and then wakes up in the outback and has no idea what's happened and, and kind of has no idea who this guy is. So Maybe this will be the job that Casey needs. To, to Unless he dies. Yeah. Um, having away writers. <laughs> <laughs> now, Nick, new to the show, how, how is it hanging out with these guys? Uh, yeah, these guys will be amazing. They um, they have a really brotherly sort of energy on and off screen, so uh, I felt welcome in that from day one, which was which was great. And um, yeah, I just dove straight in as the, um, the dark character I got to play. That was that was a lot of fun, a lot of hours in the mirror. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, if you're a newcomer, tell us 
What's the biggest sort of preconceived idea you had about the cast of Home and Away? And in fact, now that you're there, the biggest shock that you've got. Do you know what I mean? Like, if you, if you had to do... Because there are so many fans of Home and Away out there who, who probably have ideas about, you know, what Steve's like, or what's, what was the biggest preconception you had um, that's been shattered? Yeah, I don't know. I, most of them are a lot more down to earth than I thought. I thought there was going to be a few... A few bigger heads in there. Yeah. Not, it's, it's a, wow. Just a big family, I think I've described it as uh, once before. And um, yeah, I just felt absolutely welcome from, from day one, from the cast and the crew. And yeah. everyone just has so much fun on set. It is ridiculous. I don't believe that I actually get paid, and these guys get paid to, to do this. Um, um, guys, before we go, camel, what's the taste like? It's pretty chewy. What about the sure. particular part of the camel that you ate, mate? Let's not go there. <laughs> oh, no, we're there. We're there. No, we're there. No, 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 no. Let's just so say they, they, they have to make good <laughs> use on the plate. They have to make good use of the camel out there. Actually, we should do two hops. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go with that. Let's go with that. Sorry, man. Now, hang on. Hey, hey. Great shake. Like, there you go. Steve Lincoln and Nick, and you can catch all the suspense and drama on Home and Away tonight. It's always full of suspense and drama. Uh, tonight, 7 o'clock, right here on 7th Street. Camel <laughs> <laughs> You didn't need to say it. No. Like, I, I think it's it's got chicken. It's got a big sun. It tastes like chicken. It tasted... Now it tastes wrong. <laughs> How do you not do that? It sounds wrong. It tastes yeah. wrong. Good. Thanks, guys. Still to come. Are you, are you the sort of person who always wants to save the day? We're going to find out how you can rescue yourself from the need to rescue others. You need to rescue him. Sorry, yeah, I need rescue. Yeah. <laughs> one of the best Gundam-style parodies ever. Uh,